That's Peter Brewing with AV Showrooms. I'm here with Mark Conti of Veloci Audio at the New York Audio and AV Show. Hello, Peter, and hello to your uh, viewers and readers. Um, we're showing here today with our latest line stage, the LS1, which has recently been enhanced. Uh, pure tube using the 6H30s and also a pure lithium dual mono power supply. So batteries, purity, sweetness. Um, so you're effectively off the grid with it. Effectively, we are off the grid. We use an analog supply for charging and the like. Mm -hmm. um, now, I will say that we are also showing with our monoblock amplifiers, which are um, in pre-production mm -hmm. and will be out shortly. They are also battery powered. Mm -hmm. Your blind stage is one of the most beautiful pieces in the industry today. Yes, and as you can see, Peter, the tubes basically come out the front of the unit because we love tubes and we want people to be able to see them. Mm -hmm. Well, it's great looking, viewers. I mean, if you really can get a feel for it here, if I get down and close, and I mean, they're not hot to the touch or... No, no, not at all. Basically, the entire front of the chassis and faceplate form a heat sink uh, of how we make this. These tubes are okay. not just plugged into a board. They have their own okay. custom module, and so the heat sinking is throughout the face of the unit. Okay. Um, essentially, very simple controls in the front for level and turning on and off. Mm -hmm. All the rest of the controls appear in the remote. Let me hold that. You may. Oh, viewers, that's heavy. That's, that's substantial. That's a... Well, it's yeah. machined from yeah. billet uh, aluminum, and, yeah. and all the nomenclature is laser engraved so it won't wear off, and it's a product built for the long term. Well, that's a good touch, because that does happen over time with many remote controls. Yeah, those, uh, those uh, letters and numbers will not come off. Now, these are the power supplies for the unit? Uh, they are not technically no, the, the power, power supplies. The, battery, uh, the batteries are contained inside the our unit? main units. Okay. These we call smart supplies, mm -hmm. and basically they're the interface to the wall. Uh, okay. They plug into the wall with very inert, inexpensive power cords and mm -hmm. no line conditioning required. Mm -hmm. Essentially, we power off the unit, mm -hmm. charging occurs automatically. Mm -hmm. When we turn the unit on, the charger is completely shut off, so there's no noise in the system. There's a small analog supply for doing things like heating the tubes and providing voltage for the, uh, for the volume control and the mm -hmm. like. And the same is true with the amplifiers. Yeah, let's look at them, please. Sure. The amps essentially are hybrid designs. It would not be possible to battery power a tube amp of any substance. Mm -hmm. These are 400 watt monoblocks and can play for 40 to 60 hours on a charge. Mm -hmm. um, essentially what happens is we have a tube driver stage in these amplifiers mm -hmm. and then the output is a solid state device, class D, mm -hmm. for its efficiency. Mm -hmm. We transform or couple the tube to the solid state device and get the best of both worlds. Very smooth sound, a great deal of power, very, very good efficiency. Right now, this pair of amps is only drawing about 20 to 25 watts out of the wall. Again, laser engraving, half inch thick rear face plates. Oh, look at that, yeah. You know, so, so they're robust, but in this case, they're small with zero heat. And again, you, what's a wattage per channel? 400 watts at, into 4 ohms, mm -hmm. and we would be looking at about 300 to 320 into an 8 ohm load. These represent kind of a green solution to amplifiers because they are powerful and yet very, very efficient, draw very little current. And in the charging mode, Peter, we only draw about uh, 80 to 100 watts when we charge, but charging is only about one-tenth of the listening time. So as an example, with the line stage, if you listen for four hours, it charges in about 15 minutes. I'll be darned. So, other questions or things of note? Uh, no, I think what we want to do now, viewers, is sit down and take a listen. Great. Sounds wonderful, Peter. Good. Thank good. you very much. Very. Thank you very much, too.
watching some of the best sound of the show.